And at number 10, Tiger Woods. Tiger Woods was on top of the world until a massive cheating scandal derailed his entire career. In 2009, he became a billionaire, but in the same year, everything changed after his wife, Elin Nordegren, learned that Tyler had been cheating on her for years. It started when the tabloids exposed that he was having an affair with a nightclub manager named Rachel Yuchatel. Then a few days after that, he crashed his car in front of his mansion. It was rumored that his wife chased him out of their house. After all this was revealed, countless more women came forward, revealing they had had also cheated with Tiger. Tiger addressed everything in a statement saying, quote, I was unfaithful. I had affairs and I cheated. What I did was unacceptable. I hurt my wife, my kids, my mother, my wife's family, my friends, my foundation, and kids around the world who admired me. Then in 2010, the couple got a divorce and Tiger's golf performance tanked for years after. And at number nine, Ashton Kutcher. While Ashton Kutcher was married to Demi Moore, he was caught red-handed cheating on her. This all went down in 2011 when paparazzi photos exposed that Ashton was partying with a 22-year-old blonde girl in his bedroom at the Hard Rock Hotel in San Diego. Things were made even worse by the fact that the photos were leaked right before him and Demi's six year anniversary together. The craziest part of the story is that Demi actually knew who the other woman was and explained the meeting in a memoir. Apparently their whole family was at a bowling alley when Ashton went to change his shoes. The girl then gave Ashton her number on a napkin. Apparently Ashton actually showed her the number that night and they joked about how funny that it was. Ashton made it seem like she had nothing to worry about, but sadly that was not true and Ashton did get into contact with this girl. They divorced shortly after. And at number eight, Justin Timberlake. I could probably make an entire list on just Justin Timberlake's cheating because he's been caught a number of times doing scandalous things with other women. The most recent incident of Timberlake getting caught red handed took place in 2019. While married to Jessica Beale, photos were leaked showing him getting handsy with his co star at the time, Alicia Wainwright. The pictures were taken in New Orleans while they were filming when they all decided to go out on their night off. They went to a local bar, and in the pictures, you can see him holding her hand, her putting her hand on his leg, and all around his super flirty stuff. Fans also pointed out that Justin also wasn't wearing his wedding ring. For obvious reasons, this started a huge cheating rumor mill, but Justin released a public statement saying that nothing happened further than what everyone saw in the photos. Yeah, right. Jessica decided to stay with him and work through things. Signing at number seven is Kris Jenner. I cover a lot of celebrity drama across our channels, and I'm not gonna lie, I never knew about this one. This one came as a complete shock to me when I was researching. Kris wrote a memoir in 2000 2011, and in it, she admitted to having an affair with her first husband, Rob Kardashian. Her memoir, titled Kris Jenner and All Things Kardashian, dished all the details where she revealed that she had an affair with a false name that she called Ryan. But her friend, Todd Waterman, later admitted during an interview that Ryan was actually him. When Chris was asked about this whole thing during an interview, she just strongly stated that her only regret in life was divorcing Rob Kardashian, who, if you don't know, did pass away. And at number six, Khloe Kardashian. These two were not married when Tristan cheated, but they were in a long term relationship with a child on the way. I'm sure we all know by now, but third trimester Tristan earned that name from when he was caught on tape cheating on Khloe days away from her giving birth. Although the cheating was exposed months later, the footage was taken at a hookah lounge in Washington, D.C. in 2017. And the footage is pretty bad. It shows Tristan with two girls, one he is making out with, and the other is grabbing his junk. And just when it couldn't get any worse, more footage came out showing Tristan taking a different girl into his hotel room months later. So clearly, this wasn't the only time that he was cheating, and he wasn't really that discreet about it either. At number five, we have Vanessa Bryan and her late former husband of 20 years, basketballer Kobe Bryant. Kobe had previously admitted to his affairs in 2003 while he was facing essay allegations from a Colorado woman. It seemed he was on the brink of also losing Vanessa along the way, as at one point he was sure she would be done with him. Instead, Vanessa stuck it out with Kobe through the publicly scandalous issue. Things seemed great for them until 2011 when another woman claimed she engaged in an affair with the former sports star. However, after Vanessa promptly filed for divorce, the ordeal was dropped and they reconciled in 2013. Kobe was captured all over the country with a variety of women who were not his wife when Vanessa reportedly hired an army of private investigators to figure out what was going on. And it was said that the PIs gathered quite the incriminating evidence against him. A close insider to Vanessa once described Vanessa's overall emotions over the situation, where they referred to Kobe as out of control due to his various affairs over the course of their marriage. Apparently, whenever Kobe was caught red-handed in the past, he would smooch his wife with expensive gifts ranging from cars to jewelry. However, as the source once said, each time he promised to reform, and each time he broke his promise. And at number two, Hugh Grant. This might be the worst case of cheating because not only was it on unethical 
unethical, the cheating was also illegal too. This took place back in 2005 while Grant was with Elizabeth Hurley. Hugh Grant was arrested after police discovered that he was getting intimate with a woman he paid $60 to. This is one of those cases where the news of the act would have made headlines even if he wasn't cheating with another huge actor. But despite the fact that he cheated, she stayed with him for five years after that, but they eventually broke up down the road. Thankfully, she's been able to move on from it and has a great sense of humor. Apparently, the former couple are actually even still close to this day. And finally, number one, Arnold Schwarzenegger. This is another cheating scandal that broke the internet because it was something straight out of a movie. Many years after it happened, it was exposed that Arnold cheated on his wife, Maria Shriver, with their housekeeper. Even worse, she got pregnant after the affair and had a child that Arnold kept hidden from his family. The affair was kept on the low until 2011 when the LA Times uncovered the story. Apparently, the affair was revealed in couples therapy. Maria was suspicious and Arnold fessed up to it. Apparently, Maria was suspicious about their relationship after he met the housekeeper's son and he looked identical to Arnold. Arnold also issued an apology to his wife and children when the news broke out saying that he was quote truly sorry for what happened with the housekeeper named Mildred. Arnold and Maria divorced shortly after this news. Arnold reportedly knew about the child named Joseph Baina and even financially supported him without Maria knowing. At number 10 we have Selena Gomez whose back then bestie Taylor Swift seemed to confirm Selena's previous on again off again boyfriend Justin Bieber had cheated on her following fan speculation. There had been endless rumors of Justin being unfaithful back then between 2011 to 2014 but he and Selena continued to reconcile and break up for years after, each time while fans assumed they were officially done. Right before Justin tied the knot with his childhood friend and current wife Haley Baldwin in 2018, rumors of Selena and Justin's relationship resurfaced. But by 2019, Taylor had basically stepped in to save her best friend. At the time, Taylor was fresh off her back and forth feud with singer Katy Perry and seems to be on a path of airing it all out via Tumblr one weekend. On it, she details her issues with record executive Scooter Braun and naturally with Kanye West and Justin Bieber. This of course is where things get a bit messy. Even Suicide Squad actress Cara Delevingne ended up getting involved at one point. Still, it was inevitable that Taylor's own fans found themselves right in the middle of the mess over multiple social sites. However, one fan in particular responded to Justin's we haven't gotten to communicate our differences comment, which was alluding to the rumors surrounding him cheating on Selena, as well as some of Taylor's issues with Kanye through a comment that stated, you cheated on her best friend and then publicly sided with the man who made revenge against her. Was she supposed to invite you over for tea? F out of here. Where the quote confirmation came from was Taylor liking the post, which obviously led a majority of the internet to believe Taylor confirmed the Jelena rumors. At number 9 we have Beyonce, who remained loyally devoted to her still husband Jay-Z after he confirmed having cheated on her. Naturally, the world was shocked to see Hollywood's favorite couple going into shambles, especially after Beyonce's sister, Solange Knowles, was seen attacking Jay-Z in an elevator. In light of the incident though, mass speculation spread that Solange was merely playing tit for tat because of the rumors stimulating from Jay-Z cheating on her sister. Both stars eventually hinted at said gossip through their music, with Beyonce releasing Lemonade and Jay-Z dropping 444. But before this, Jay-Z gave us the direct scoop for the very first time publicly during a New York Times styled magazine interview where he discussed his life back then. Beyonce and Jay-Z also had prior plans to release a collaborative album in light of everything as they were creating music together, but ended up deciding to go with their solo projects. Jay-Z did a Admit that therapy helped him deal with his past issues and prevented what looked to be their incoming divorce at the time. However, nowadays the rapper singer Twosome have since renewed their vows and appear to be much more content with their current life. At number 8 we have Gabrielle Union and former fiance Dwayne Wade. The two engaged back in 2013 but briefly separated during the time when Dwayne had conceived a baby boy with Aja Matoyer. The announcement for Dwayne's new bundle of joy was released worldwide less than a week following Dwayne's engagement announcement with Gabrielle. Despite this, Dwayne has referred to his child as a blessing. Oppositely, Gabrielle received infinite hardships from the strain in the relationship, which started off in 2008. Fast forwarding to 2021, Gabrielle talked about their issues in more detail, urging others to be careful when seeking advice from people who have not successfully healed from their own traumas and are trying to help someone else. Regardless, the couple managed to work through their heavy stress and have seemingly become happier in their current marriage of a little under 8 years. They share a younger daughter named Kavya James. And in number 7, Kevin Hart. 
Kevin Hart is another Hollywood star that has been labeled a serial cheater because of his infidelity while married to both of his wives. The worst was when he was caught cheating on his pregnant wife, Iniko Parrish, in 2017. This was exposed in a video where you could see Kevin getting in the back of a car with another woman. After the footage went viral, the internet started claiming that he had cheated on his wife who was 8 months pregnant. Then some more footage was released that seemed to be a tape showing Kevin cheating on his wife well in the act. Apparently the footage was filmed as an extortion attempt. His wife Aniko later talked about how she found out about it in the first place. She said it was through a DM message on Instagram. Her exact words were quote, I was about 7 or 8 months pregnant and I was having breakfast and I opened my phone and immediately I just lost it. Kevin finally admitted to it and released a public apology to his wife and family and the two of them worked through it and are still together. At number 6 we have rapping duo Cardi B and Offset who for starters are indeed still together and married to this day. However, there were quite a few instances in their timeline when things were looking a little blurry and at one point the couple was certainly headed for divorce. Amid chatter that Offset was unfaithful throughout the entirety of their relationship. Reports of infidelity on Offset's half have been floating around from the very start, but most notably images of Offset being unfaithful to Cardi were once leaked off his iCloud by Packers. However, Cardi has insisted on her desire to keep their marriage afloat and work through their issues, stating that she has no reason to explain their situation, which quote happens to everyone, to anybody who asks this of her. Yet the two did have a momentary separation in December 2018. Cardi even went as far as filing for divorce of Offset's alleged endless infidelity, who had a previous bad rep for being a womanizer. Offset has denied the gossip time and time again, but multiple women have reportedly stepped forward to inform the female rapper, which again led to their eventual temporary divorce. According to a source from E, Cardi did attempt to forgive and put her trust back into Offset in 2017, but it seemingly backfired on her as she was later played with embarrassment and only attempted to move on at first for their child. After deeming her situation as enough is enough, the narrative that Cardi dumped Offset for good is no longer viable due to the fact that they are still currently together and seem to be doing much better. Halfway through our list at number 5 is Jude Law. He and Sienna Miller were once one of Hollywood's it couples but then he got exposed for cheating on her. His story hit closer to home, literally, because he cheated on Sienna with their children's nanny. The affair happened in 2006 and he admitted to cheating with her nanny Daisy Wright which was happening on the regular. He ended up releasing a public apology to her and Sienna spoke up about it saying that it was a private moment where she had to get her heart broken in front of the entire world. But at the same time had he not been exposed she may have never found out that this was even happening. So it was kind of like a blessing in disguise but that would freaking suck. Oh my god, I would hate going through that in the public eye. At number 4 we have basketball player Nick Young who revealed he cheated on his former fiance and musical artist Iggy Azalea through a previously leaked secret video. At the time the two braved the storm by attempting to work things out as they remained engaged, but surely enough Nick showed that he was not willing to change much. In the words of Iggy she detailed, I broke up with Nick because I found out he had brought other women into our home while I was away and caught them on security footage. According to reports Iggy actually received her payback by burning all his things in a bonfire. Big yikes. In the midst of their separation, Iggy also addressed the gossip that stated she left Nick because he had another child with the mother of his young son. But Iggy admitted that she didn't even know about that until it was revealed in E! News. And at number 3, Dixie D'Amelio. Griffin and Dixie were the hot new TikTok couple after they started publicly dating. But that changed pretty fast when it was revealed that Griffin was cheating. Dixie did not take it lying down and decided to make a savage TikTok video exposing all the receipts. In the short video, viewers see snippets of tons of flirty conversations. Griffin had with other girls, where he made his intentions very clear. One of these Snapchats shows Griffin clearly saying that he's single, as well as others when he's talking about flying girls out to LA to see them, and is clearly talking about hooking up with them. Then Dixie shows a super lengthy text message that he sent to her, apologizing for the cheating, with a message reading in part that he knows he was wrong and hurt her, but he still cares about her. Thankfully, she didn't accept the BS and dumped him immediately. At number 2, we have the Osborne duo known as Sharon and Ozzy respectively. As one of the biggest rock stars of not just his time, but all time. I think it was just to mostly Sharon's surprise when she found out that Ozzy was unfaithful a lot. By that point, Sharon was seemingly done with Ozzy, but around the next year and in light of their 40 year history, they ended up coming back to one another again and have been married ever since. It's unclear whether she decided to drop everything and forgive him at the time or now, but Sharon has expressed her understanding of how many men would also find it hard to remain faithful if they spent the day in Ozzy's world. Still, this doesn't mean Ozzy is proud of his past by any means. 
During a British GQ sit down, the legendary rocker admitted that one of his biggest life regrets was having cheated on his wife. Quote, I've done some pretty outrageous things in my life. I regret cheating on my wife. I don't do it anymore. I got my reality check and I'm lucky she didn't leave me. I was pissed off with myself, but I broke her heart. Ozzy and Sharon married back in 1982 and shared three children named Amy, Kelly, and Jack. Moving on to number nine is David Letterman. He was with his wife for over 20 years and married for less than six months when he admitted to having an affair with different women that worked for him. The worst part is he openly admitted it on air on his live talk show, which is incredibly awkward, specifically saying that he had sex with his longtime assistant, Stephanie Burkett. The scandal all started because Stephanie's boyfriend, Joe Halderman, a producer at CBS, allegedly tried to extort Letterman for $2 million in exchange for his silence. So Letterman just took it into his own hands and decided to announce it on his show so that the truth would be known and he didn't have to pay anyone to keep his mouth shut. You know what I'm saying? But he and his wife are still together regardless of what happened and he recently said that they are happier than ever. So at number 7 we have leading Twilight stars Kristen Stewart and Robert Pattinson. Back when Robert became romantically involved with Kristen, who played his on screen lover in the romantic action vampire franchise, fans were elated with the discovery of them dating. As private as the two attempted to remain about the relationship, fans were practically obsessed with their fairy tale type of romance. However, fans were soon extremely crushed to find out that Kristen had cheated on Robert with her Snow White and the Huntsman director, Rupert Sanders, a film which included Rupert's then wife, Liberty Ross. Despite the fact that it was revealed the two never slept together, Kristen still gave a public apology to Robert, who forgave her even though they broke it off less than a year later. Robert referred to their relationship as something that was normal in young people, and it never really recovered after that. However, in the years since her affair, Kristen detailed how she managed to get caught up in the scandal, explaining that the cheating was merely a kiss shared between her and Rupert. And even though the stars have been separated for nearly a decade now, Kristen revealed she would have been content marrying Robert if they had gotten to that point. Still, Kristen did acknowledge how the intense pressure around them as young public figures also played a part. In conclusion, the Twilight lead split, and so did Rupert and his wife. Despite Kristen understanding how their scandal was the nail in the coffin of her former relationship, she didn't forget to inform us how the media storm surrounding her relationship with Pattison made her a stronger person. Halfway number five, Ryan Garcia. Ryan was not only caught cheating on his fiance, he was caught on camera. A paparazzi video showed Ryan and Malu Trevejo making out outside of a restaurant. And things got nasty when his pregnant fiance, who we already shared one child with, called out both of them online. His fiance posted on her Instagram that she was away visiting her family and thought Ryan was training. But sadly, he was out cheating. After this, Malu made her own apology video, saying that she knew that he had a kid, but she didn't know that he was engaged or had another baby on the way. And as a last ditch effort to save his reputation, Ryan made his own statement on Instagram, writing that him and his fiance Andrea were not engaged at the time, but they were still together and he was caught up in the moment. At number three, we have reality star Kourtney Kardashian and her previous partner, Scott Disick. Now, Scott has been surrounded by rumors of him cheating on Kourtney throughout the duration of their Keeping Up with the Kardashian filming. Despite the fact that the two former partners share three children together, Scott was reportedly unable to remain a faithful lover to Courtney. Apparently, Courtney had discovered evidence of unfaithfulness on Scott's part multiple times, and yet the two remained on and off for a whopping nine years before calling it quits for good in 2015. Surely it's not much of a surprise here that the Kardashian crew was not a fan of Scott by any means. They thought he had a horrible attitude and needed to tend to his previous alcohol use. The blend of issues often led to altercations stemming from Scott's behavior, who has admitted in the past that he struggled with alcohol basically up until they split. However, nowadays, Courtney and Scott have both moved on in the love department and are doing a great job at co-parenting, possibly even more so than when they were actually together. 